I was diagnosed with prostate cancer. The level of cancer required medical intervention and was not a matter of wait and see. The two doctors I saw were Dr. Preston Sprenkel and Dr. James Yu, and both gave me a great deal of confidence that my problem was manageable. When you're trying to radiate the prostate with radiotherapy, you always have to add in a margin. Um, you have to expand your volume to allow for movement and error. Prior to space war, that margin went into the rectum. With space war, it allows us to treat the prostate without compromising at that border between the prostate and the rectum because that border isn't there anymore. There's a big space. Dr. Yu, our radiation oncologist, brought it up to me one day as this interesting new technology that allowed them to deliver the same radiation treatment with the same curative doses uh, with less toxicity. By increasing that physical space and decreasing that radiation dose, it really preserves a man's quality of life. The space or treatment is not a medical process or procedure that needs to be feared in any way. There's no pain involved. There's very little impact on a person's lifestyle or even on the day that they have the treatment. For the patient, I would say the spacer is a great option because it has minimal side effects. The procedure is easily tolerated and really has a tremendous benefit. I would encourage any of my patients who are going to have radiation is that they ask about SpaceOR and they ask if that is something that the radiation oncologist is comfortable using. I strongly encourage all of my patients who are having radiation to have a SpaceOR placed before treatment. Especially if you have a very curable cancer, right? And you're deciding between different treatment options. Quality of life is just as important as beating the cancer. Most physicians are probably like me. You know, sometimes you wake up in the middle of the night and you wonder about your patients and you worry about them, especially as you're planning the radiation treatment. Having a space there between the prostate and the rectum reduces a lot of that worry. I've always been a very active person. It has not diminished my abilities to do the things I love and to do more of them. And if a friend or a family member came to me and asked me what would be the best way to handle prostate cancer, I would definitely recommend the space or For me, it has had very little consequences, either the day of the treatments, the weeks and months afterward, several years afterward. My greatest hope that it would be available to all persons everywhere.